Welcome to ActiveNet. Here is a user-friendly video to show you how to navigate the website. You can start and stop this video anytime by hitting the spacebar. This is our homepage. Go to the city's ActiveNet website by going to apm.activecommunities.com slash rpv. On the homepage, you can create an account, then you can easily sign up and pay for events online. First, find your event on our homepage under the click here to preview or register for activities. If you know the event you would like to sign up for, you can also use the search option. Now that you have found your event, let's create an account. Here's how to create an account. First, click on create an account. The first page will ask for your name and address. Once that is complete, click next and go to the next page. The second page asks for contact information. Type in phone numbers and emails so we can contact you. Once that is complete, click Next and go to the next page. The third page asks for personal information. Please enter your gender, date of birth or age category, medical alert, and how did you hear about us? Once that page is complete, click Next and go to the next page. The fourth page is for emergency contact information. For children, please enter emergency contact information. Ideally, this should not be the parent or guardian. The fifth page is for your account information. Please enter security information for the account. Please note, login name is not case sensitive, but your password is. You will also need to select or enter a security question. Once this is complete, you can select Create Account or Create an Account and add a family member. Then a box will appear that will say, Thank you. Your request for new customer account has been successfully transmitted. A login name will be sent to you by email. Your login name and password will allow access to the advanced features of this site after you validate your email address by clicking the validation link. Press OK. Remember to write down your login and password so you can find it at a later time. Next, you will need to go to your email inbox and validate your new account. To validate your online registration, please click this link. Now you can log in with your email address and password. Once that is complete, you can register for activities. Here is a page with a list of activities. I chose PVIC Donation, then choose Add to Cart. The next page is an enrollment page. Select who will be participating in this activity and click on the name. Then continue to Enrollment Page. Once you have reviewed the fees, click Proceed to Checkout. This will take you to Review Waivers page. Once you have read the Review Waivers statement, click on the Review Waivers box and put your initial in the Initials box. Click Next. The last page is an online receipt with all of your information. You will also receive a confirmation email. You can also share this page via social media or continue shopping and search for other activities. Let's continue searching for other activities and take you through the credit card process. I have selected January 23rd Night Hike. Then click on the Add to Cart tab. Then click on the Who Will Be Participating in This Activity tab. Then click Next. You can also add other participants for this activity. Once you are on this page, you can review and initial the box on the page and press Continue. You are now on the Select Fees page. Here, you can review the activities and then press Proceed to Shopping Cart. Once you have reviewed the shopping cart, press the Proceed to Checkout tab. This page will ask you to review the waivers and check the box. You will also need to initial the box as well. Then press Next. The next page will take you to the credit card information. Once you have completed this page, press Pay and Finish. You will receive a confirmation email and you'll be all set for your activity. Thank you for watching our tutorial on how to use the website. We look forward to seeing you at our next activity.